All right, back again with a little bit of Conan. Got my drum. Eating my drum. Hell yeah. <laughs> Uh, let's go beat up on some people. Let's bring DBA in. I know he's, uh, in and playing. DBA, what's up? Howdy, howdy. Sweet. Let's do it. I think I'm going to make a, um, I'm also going to make a thing. Can you come up here and move your thing? Sure. Your big giant thing you got going on here? Yep. I'm going to make a shrine to... My God. Uh, yeah, let's see here. Oops. Ooh, almost deleted yours by accident. Hey, what does this take care of? It says too close to an object of the same type. Yeah, go the other. Which way are you trying to go? I'm just trying to move it. Okay, let me move it down so that it, I think, I think our shrines are going to have to be um, farther apart. Put yours on one end of the building as far as you can. But it won't let me move it because it says it's too close to another of the same type. There is nothing up there. Get rid of that dialogue and go back up there because maybe I was, I was trying to put mine down at the same time. Maybe that was the problem. No, no. How can you, there be something of the same type? There's nothing up there. There's no other shrine up there. So. Well, I think it's detecting the current shrine for some reason. What current shrine? I mean, oh, that's one that I have up here when I'm trying to move it. Oh, well, then you have to move it off to the ground and then put it back in place and then move it back up to the again. I'm trying to do that. It's still giving me the. Michael, what's going on? First one. Hi, DBA Midnight. What's up? Yeah, kind of a like a last minute thing. I was um, a little bit tired today, so I kind of fell asleep on the couch. Gather my resources for mine here. Uh, okay, I was able to pull it down below. 360. Gosh darn it. If you climb while you're moving, it doesn't. So I can't, I can't, um, get it back up top. Dang it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to cause you all this trouble. For your stinky god. Cannibal eater. So you would have to dismantle, yeah. Yeah, and I, I'm gonna lose. As you make sacrifices, you gain power on the thing. Oh. So I've lost. I only lose one. It's not that big a deal. But okay. Well, uh, sorry about that. Sorry, I made you kill your god. Um. Let's see. I 
am I missing here? Oh, I need more stone. Jabbing, what's going on? Okay, I put it back up on top again. Hmm. Jeff, hey, what's going on, I buddy? <clears throat> make any more sacrifices and potentially lose, I want you to build yours to make sure that you can do yours on the other side. Uh, I think... Yeah, that's a really good question. Um... Cause there, it, there's a bag it, here. And yeah, I, that's the thing I can't pick up. You can't pick this up? Nope. Can you pick it up? No. I think because you're probably... Hmm. I don't know. That that was the... Every time you sacrifice to your altar, you get one of those. And you need 30 of those to upgrade to the second level altar. I see. Well... Can't take it out. You can't move it. So it's just lost. Now you made me feel bad. You're making me feel bad, dude. Uh huh. Uh huh. Are you putting it in a horrible spot to begin with? All right, I'll just put mine <laughs> on the ground down here. You don't want to put it up here, seriously? Seriously, man. I don't put it up there with your stinky god. Well, then why did I move it off to the side? Because it looked ugly in the middle, anyways. <laughs> Let me see here. Hold on. Let me see if I can get mine moved. I think my problem with mine is going to be too big. Yeah. Yours is. Well, you're going to have to do stairs. Yours is a t tiny little god. And, um, <laughs> mine is much more powerful than yours. Yeah, we I, just, I can see we how. We just don't yeah. have some little rinky-dink pit of fire. Nope. Too close. Alright. Still getting the too close thing. Oh. Must be on the ground. Uh, for those of you who have played the game extensively, is there a way to get rid of spawning creatures? Like, you see the creatures behind me? If I put something down in their spawn area, like floor or something like that, will they respawn over there? Need to get some iron bars and branches. I wonder if you can eat the uh, special meat that I cook. I mean, it is kind of gross, but... And I got some thick hide, by the way. Uh, I did as well. I have about... 70. I've been putting all the heads that I've gotten in the tanner's table. I don't know if that's the best place for them or not. Are you talking about the already pre-mounted ones? No, no, the ones that I cut off when I'm using uh, my axe. Oh, I have 40. Did you wipe that whole camp out already or no? I did. Man. What do you need 40 of? What do I need 40 of? No, I have 40 of the thick leather. Come on, let's go explore. Uh, you know what? Actually, before we explore, let's put down a thrall thing. And then we also need to make a some sort of club, right? 
Uh, weighted club for knocking out foes. Yeah, that. Leather and branch. Let me go get that. Nobody in chat knew the answer to that question? If you can get rid of a spawn point of a creature by putting down stuff? There's got two guys over here that I would really love to get rid of by putting down some sort of spawn point. Uh, what what do you do to, to get rid of them? I need 200 wood, 200 stone. 50, 20. Well, I gotta do a lot of stuff here. Place a floor in that area. Bunch of sandstone foundations will do. Do I have to like cover a wide area or does it just have to be like just a handful? Somehow I got rid of the rolling harvest numbers, and I don't know how I did that. Oh, there we go. It's back. Okay. That was weird. Where's the, uh, is the thrall thing a journey, or is that <clears throat> just a knowledge? Uh, it's the knowledge you have to unlock, and then you get a round thing. A wide area where they would uh, spawn. Okay, I'm gonna have to do that a little bit later because um, I don't know that I have all the stuffs for that. Yeah, I still haven't figured out how to make bricks. How to make bricks? Yeah, you know? Yeah, put stone in the furnace. I got bricks in there. Oh, uh, okay. Because I need um, 250 bricks to upgrade my... My altar. The iron bars. Have that in here somewhere. Oh, I also probably should pick up. Well, I don't know. Should I be? What harvest should I be using on these um, animals? What animals? Depends on what you want, because the cleaver the knife and the axe all give different slightly different things yep overlapping with another object really come on okay uh yeah don't don't spam tips I think spamming tips is, uh, might be a little bit, I mean, wait for it to ask, is the best course of action on anything that I play. Because part of the adventure of playing a game is kind of figuring out what's going on. And the game's not new, I mean, it's been out for a long time, I, if I really want to know, I'm sure Google can tell me exactly what I want. But, you know, things like spur of the moment, like, how do I do this? Because 
I'm in a pinch and I can't go switch between Google is kind of where you guys come into play. So for that, I really appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Skinning knife is for skins mostly. Cleaver is for meat. Pick is for bones. And then, I guess, you know, there are other things that come out of... Oh, you got yourself a puppy? Oh, no, that's a yep. taxidermed hyena. <laughs> it's a puppy. Well, it's... Just it's not alive. It's puppy. not an alive one. <laughs> okay, is there something else I need to make with the thralls? And there's, like... Fiber bindings. A twisted rope strong enough to drag a captive a short distance. Yeah, we need one of those. I'll make five just in case. Uh, don't really know how to attach that to somebody yet, but we're going to find out. Yep, yep. All right, we'll stop killing everybody off, okay? Sure. And now, uh, do we want to, um, is there a place we want to go to that has better quality thralls? Well, I think... I came across one today that I think we absolutely have to get. Oh, yeah? Mm -hmm. What's that? Well, I'll show you when we get there. You know, don't be all excited. Uh, you know, uh, okay, yeah. I don't want to spoil the surprise. Jump in the gun, man. It's like you want to open up your Christmas gifts four weeks in advance. What <laughs> the hell? Uh, let's see. I need eight leather to make this thing. You might want to make one, too. It's... um. I was about to say I was going to call it a Turduncan, but it's not a Turduncan. It's, um... You can't put all the hides into the... You gotta tan some for leather, buddy. Well, I... <clears throat> I wasn't sure. So we had hyena hides, which we were turning into the other hides, right? And then we were tanning them? Because you can tan them directly. And I just wasn't sure if that was the right... Tan them directly. You talk about. Or you can tan hyena pelts directly. You don't have to convert them into hides first. What do they get turned into? A hyena. Leather. Did Just they really? Straight leather. Oh, yep. I, di I didn't know that. I didn't know you could do a a non hide. See how it has a picture of a hide there? Uh huh. Uh huh. And you're saying it doesn't have to be a hide. Well, I think that is a type of hide. It's a scrap. No, is it's it... a hyena pelt. It's a type of hide. Why oh, you? Let me see this. I'm gonna take. How many does it take? Two. I don't know. Have you tried it? Or are you just telling yes, me? Yes, I stopped it. I stopped it. it w I put it into here originally, and it started doing its thing. And I was like, "Oh crap! I better stop that," because I remember he wanted me to turn them into hides first. No, if we don't so I don't know if the exchange rate is the same. Uh, I don't know. It's a... Uh, what is it? Uh, one for three? Or three for one? I think the rate is different. Possibly. Let me just drop one in. Okay, you can't process just one hide. Can you process one hyena belt? No, you can't process... Wait. Yes, you can. One hyena pelt will turn into one leather. I didn't hit the start button. As soon as that's done, let me see here. One hide does not turn into 
a leather. How many hide you get out of a pelt if you just convert? Two hides. So it takes three hides to make a leather. And... How many pelts do you get? Uh, interesting. Gonna have to figure out the numbers on that one. Okay. I didn't know that, sir. Good deal. Alright, back to what we were doing. It was making a thumper. What did I need for the rest of the thumper? I needed eight leather for the thumper. And let's get you a thumper. Let you make your own thumper set. It has your name on it. All right. What's the knowledge I need to unlock for a thumper? I think it's the thall one, right? Yeah, the uh, thrall taker. It's under survival. All right. And you get the. What's this thing called? A trunch con trunch truncheon truncheon. And you also get the fiber binding so you can beat somebody over the head and then <laughs> drag them along. Oh, now I got a Thrall Taker journey. I don't a journey opened up when I, um, I did the knowledge. Yeah, I think we might want to do a couple wheels of pain over time. Can this... you only put one person in each wheel? I think so. I don't know. I have no idea. <laughs> No slaving, huh? And we have to feed him something. Which I think is made in this... Alchemy station? No. Sure it's not the uh, cook station? Where is the cook station? Here. Oh, well they don't give us recipes in this station. Yeah. I don't know what we have to feed them. I think we have to feed them something. Maybe... I don't know. We're about to find out. Maybe we should start with like a a nobody thrall before we go for a good thrall. Yep. Yep. All right, you ready? Uh, I've got to craft the truncheon. Where do I craft the truncheon? Armor's uh, bench. No, 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 no. In your backpack. Ah, uh, okay. You have a tip for food for changing their minds? <laughs> well, what's your tip for changing their minds? Tell them you give them super spicy burritos until they submit. Where is their food made at? What station is their food made at? Because I didn't see it anywhere. I wonder if we have to get into the higher levels of cooking. A regular cooking fire.
Really? Hold on. Does a regular cooking fire have, uh... Hmm. Listed recipes? I th thought it didn't. It doesn't have any listed recipes. Why did you put dry wood into the campfire? Dude, don't put dry wood into the campfire. Why not? Because that's a special building material. I had to turn around and dry it on the dryer. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I thought I just put wood in here. I didn't think it was dry wood. It says dry wood. It's even got a different icon on it. Sorry. Fiber and seeds for gruel. Uh, hold on. I know I have a bunch of seeds somewhere. Let's try this. Sure enough. Fiber and seeds make gruel. All right. Put seeds somewhere. I got 30 gruel. I don't know how long that's going to last for, but I'll put it into the machine over here. Okay. All right. Now we're ready to go drag somebody. Sorry, I lied to you. Oh, you did? Well, I'm holding too much stuff. Gotta get rid of some of the stuff in my inventory. So when you're so, fighting you're fighting these guys, it says like they're level one this, level one that, right? Yep, yep. Sometimes level two. I think um I found a level three guy that I think would be awesome for us to have. Alright. So I think once you shoot it, that's it. There's no capturing him, right? Yeah. When you get them low enough, they kind of stand there and look kind of dazed. So I don't know if we have to get them dazed before we whack them over the head. Are you whacking up the truncheon? Yeah, there's a there's a bar above their head. Okay, he's out. All right. This guy's a fighter. I'll go ahead and pull up my truncheon. Then. Alright, knocked him unconscious. Um, okay, I think I wrapped him up. <laughs> Come on, dude! <laughs> Come with me. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's completely ridiculous. <laughs> Hit V. Hold your V key down. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Dude, this looks like fun. Do me next. Isn't that great? <laughs> okay. Since that is your wheel of pain, I'll let you put your guy on first, and then we'll see if I can do a second guy on the same wheel, and whether I need a second wheel. Yeah, it'd be... It'd make a lot of sense if you put multiple guys on there, but I don't know. Let's see here. Uh, now my archer went right in there. Okay, I try. 
Okay. He's in there, but why is he not pushing? Do I have to whip him? Oh, I had to turn him on. Yeah, this one says no more room. Gotcha. Hmm. We're going to need many of these. Down? Yeah, can you throw down another wheel? I'm scared I'm, this guy's going to get away if I let go of the rope. Yeah. Let me see. Hold on. I got to... I gotta change up a bunch of stuff here. Uh, the wheel is... 50 iron bars, 50 twine, 250 stone, 200 stone, 200 wood. I gotta get a bunch of stuff. Hold on. Do you have any stone or wood in your stuff? No. How much stuff do I have left? Definitely not enough. Oh, do I get enough for twine? Do 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 do. Where's my twine? Oh, I've been type. I've been talking this whole time. Um, I'm making bricks, so there should be some stone in there you can grab. I'm also making a plank, so there should be some wood in the carpenter's bench to grab. Okay. I'm going to grab a soda. Be right back. I don't know if I should mention it or whether that jinxes it, but at this very moment, I have no back pain. I just stood up, went to the fridge, got my soda, and I was like, wow, I don't feel pain. Shouldn't be talking about that stuff, man. Yeah. Oh, damn it, I need twine. Almost had it. Hold on. I've been doing stretches and stuff, trying. Trying. Yeah, I totally get it. Luckily, twine is something that's made relatively quickly. Oh, the, the rope is ticking down. I can see the durability on my rope is almost gone. All right, there he is. Good. Now I have to craft gruel. Good deal. Um. How do we know how long it takes him for him to be converted? Where is that info at? On Good the question. wheel. I think, like all, isn't there at the bottom a, a little progress bar on the recipe? Ah, uh, you're right. Yep. Totally right, man. Bow and arrow icon on the right has a white horizontal line. Yep. See it. Now, can you feed them better than gruel? Does it have to be gruel? I don't know. If you feed him good food, wouldn't you want to stay on the wheel? <laughs> I do 
don't you think? Drop some seeds in there. Don't have any more fiber. I just converted all my fiber over. I just grabbed a bunch, so I got 94 gruel cooking. Oh, it makes 10 at a time. Yeah, yeah well, you could, take, you could take... You could take... They make 100 and put 50 in mine. Rules easy. There's no speed up with better food. If you had a Taskmaster, it'd make it even faster. Okay. We need to get a, a Thrall that is the Master of Thralls. Fighters, archers, bearers, and dancers can be placed in the world and commanded to follow you. Yeah, man. He can fight with us. Put some more food in mine or no? Not yet. It's still brewing. It's still brewing. You know, they should make these guys like crush flour or something, man. You know, not just push this thing around, but actually be productive. Yep. I go around and they'll see how you change their minds. <laughs> okay, I put 50 extra in mine. Sweet. And 50 extra in yours. Sweet. get dark. Let's go clear out that camp, though. Alright. Do we want to be prepared in case we find a particularly good thrall? Well, we'll see them as they we hover over them. Okay, well, my rope's almost dead. I don't know how good your rope is. Oh, I made six. Oh, okay. I saw that it was limited, so I made a bunch. I'm just going to end up repairing mine. Oh, I didn't even think about repairing it. to us. Okay, I'm going to refill my water skin real fast with the shore, then I'll be ready. By the way, um, the heal potions, the aloe potions, whatever, mm -hmm. there's like 20 or 30 in the thing if you wanted to go grab them. Or grab 10 or whatever. Put them on your bar. You're making an assumption I don't have them already. Okay, but well, I didn't know. I got me uh, 10 of that and 10 bandages, man. Come prepared, dude.
TBA, you're as bad as my wife. I say let's go, and I still have to wait 15 minutes for you, dude. Oh, I've been I've been waiting here for you. I thought you were doing something with rope. I'm already over here. The camp. I'm coming. I was busy fighting alligators, waiting on you. All right, now do we want to sneak up on them okay, and come see down. what they are before we come down? Well, we have an archer, and you just picked up a, a warrior, right? Yep. Yeah. What we really need is like craftspeople. All right, blacksmith or yeah. Yeah, it's just an archer. Well, screw him. Yeah, you didn't like that, did you? Okay, don't harvest everybody, please, for your god. I also have a god. And I'd like to harvest okay. people as well. Okay. Yes. I suppose. Yes. Yeah. I hope you took the you took the goodies, huh? Oh, your your god wants harvest too? I thought you had to do uh... what? What does your god want? Human flesh and human hearts, man. <laughs> okay, I don't feel so bad about Although I eat human flesh, I don't know about you. Hey, okay, that's an archer too. We don't need him. Uh, there's okay, a. Should we just shoot him? There's a there's a crafts oh. person coming. The uh, armor there's a, oh, and a bearer three. Oh, dude, he almost killed me too. Yep, I I'm stuck. <clears throat> I'm stuck. I'm down. You're down. Yeah, I couldn't. I didn't want to kill him, so I didn't use my weapon. And I got stuck against the fence and couldn't get out. What's a bear or three do? Probably a oh, portable chest. Portable inventory is I guess. You just load them up with goodies. Well, the bear right now is clearing out all of the alligators, so I'm going to let the bear do that. Careful, don't let him get killed. Watch out. Gosh darn it. Watch out, bear's coming back. Oh, the kite disappeared on me. That's wrong. Where are you? I'm hiding. Right up by my corpse. I see you. Man, these guys respawn really fast. Watch out for this archer. Okay, I got a fighter. Fighter two, fighter one. Yeah, I think, uh... Your heart will be eaten. Just go. Go with the flow, man. One's down. I'm almost down again. What the heck? I saved you. Watch out. No one's coming after you from behind. I go to the great beast. Yes, you, you do. Go to the great beast, my friend.
I will take your heart. You can have those two guys over there. Uh, where are they? Uh, we killed them here. There's one, I guess. Oh, no, that's your body, right? It's my body, yeah. Why are you cutting two, man? Looks disturbing. Uh, I don't know where they went. And this guy looks like he respawned already. They weren't responding this fast when I, uh... Chat, Archer's coming in. I'm gonna let my corpse, one second. Dude, he's gonna shoot at you, butt. Okay, no he's not. Come on, harvest the corpse already! There it goes, finally. Uh, I don't think we need the bear, but the bear is going to come, and the bear is kind of tough. I'm going to shoot the bear. Don't kill him if you can. I want to try to get him. You want to try to get the bear? Yeah. Okay. Isn't he a level 3 bear? If he's if bears are good, then he is going to be... <sighs> yeah, but you got two on you, man. Yep. And it's hard, f hard to separate. Okay, here. Armor... I pull I pulled the armor. You got the bears right. on you. Yep, he's coming back to you. Oh shoot. The bear is tough, man. Okay, armor is down. Dude, this guy's almost got me now. Ooh. Okay, bear is down. Bears unconscious or dead? Unconscious. Nice. Okay, dragging the bear. Oh, you didn't? I thought you, uh... No, man. I just killed him. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, you distract. I'm going to, uh... Yeah, go through town. I get you. I will feast upon you. No, you won't. Blood. No, you won't. I'm going for your blood. Better be tasty. All I gotta say. Maybe get a dancer, performer. We need somebody to dance for us. Shake your hoochie mama. Hi, what are you going to do with your guy if the wheel is still busy? You going to make a third wheel? Okay, this one's still busy. Um, I guess so. I'm kind of out of options at this point. My only option is really to... How long is your bear staying conscious? I don't know. Good question. The forest or DBA's people, they follow God? Yeah, I know. We, we know. We've had this discussion already. You should be shaking hands with them or something. Instead yeah. of... Instead of like, you know, doing what he's doing. <laughs> hmm. So what are you doing to give your guy something? Like I put the hearts in and I thought the hearts, I mean they give me an antidote. Yeah, you have to craft. Um, there's 
you have to use those recipes. Every time you make a recipe, with the exception of making the weapon, it um, gives oh. you a favor. Oh, it gives you a favor? Mm. Yeah, so I think... I think um, you need flesh, right? For yours? It has to be uh, pristine flesh, so I have to get it with my weapon in oh. order to use it. Gotcha. Well, I don't, I don't eat flesh, so I just throw my flesh on the ground. It's fine. I'm doing something similar. I'm not a... Not a flesh guy. Not a fleshy guy. I have exotic meat. I haven't tried it. I, okay. <laughs> I think I've been chewing on somebody's arm, man. That's wrong. <laughs> Only if I no, absolutely had to, you know. Oh, we have no bark. We need bark for drying. Get some bark really fast. That you? Yep. You're getting bark here. I need wood. Hold on. I'm trying to make this wheel. I'm only gonna take this tree. Just need enough bark to get the drying rack going for all this meat. Though it's kind of ridiculous. We have so much meat. We should just be giving these guys meat instead of making grow. Yeah, I agree. Roll. That facts, what's well, up? Uh, spoiling. Yeah, it's spoiling like crazy. Which I think we can use for farming later, but... Oh, hey. My wheel finished, so I don't have to make another one. Nice. Did my wheel finish? Your guy's still going. Oh, maybe because mine was a level 2 guy. Possibly. Sandals I just got are actually kind of amazing. Armor value 32, agility weapon damage 3%. Changing them. Hmm, but I can't repair them. That's the downside of using the, that stuff. Oh, uh, wow. Been a while. How we been? Oh, we've been good, man. You know, busy. Family stuff always gets you going for a while, you know. Safari fighter is now following you. Sweet. All right, let's go capture the person I really want to capture. All right. We're going to need to run through that town because it's on the other side. Are you coming? I'm going towards the town. I'm going to change this guy back to guard. Hold on. Well, he seems to be doing whatever he's doing, so. We're going to be in trouble with this storm. What storm? Do I see a sandstorm? No.
Really? Yeah, I don't see a sandstorm. Because I'm taking damage. You're in a sandstorm? Yeah. I am not in a sandstorm. <laughs> uh, Nim, what's going on? You might want to go... Yeah, I'm running back. Yep. Because otherwise I'm going to die. That's kind of weird. I still may not make it back. Drink a potion, dude. Can't. Sandstorm prevents you from healing. Really? So healing stopped, yeah. <gasps> yeah, to totally strange that I don't see a sandstorm going on. Alright, I need to come back here and drop off some stuff anyways. So you're telling me if I do this reptile hide. Yeah, sure enough, I get 75 lunar out of it. Hmm. Okay, I guess if you want to make leather, that's fine. Convert it over to leather directly. But if you need hide for the armorer's bench, then you can convert it over to hide. Interesting. I wonder if the ratio is the same. Shrunken heads and all that stuff. What do you do with the shrunken heads? Can they be sold at like a store or something? Is there a, a store you can sell it at? There's no shrunk, idea. Shrunken head store. It buys heads. Sounds like each player is in its own instance. That would be weird if it was. Because you would think we're doing this stuff together. Is the storm over for you? Yes, it just it just ended. Let's go, man. Burning daylight hours. Coming, coming, coming. Diving into Planet Crafter. Plan on doing any content? Yeah, absolutely. Um, tomorrow will be starting Planet Crafter. I was going to do it tonight, but I was a little tired and I actually wound up falling asleep and didn't start to stream until 9. But the intent was to do Planet Crafter. And I think it's on sale for like 13 bucks or something right now, 16 bucks. I say we just skirt these guys. How'd you jump off the wall midway? See? Awesome. Oh, you jerk. I don't have my bow on. Give me a second. Somebody just shot at me. Yep. Come on. Go to the waterfall. Killing this lady that's shooting at me. Alright. Alright, I'm leaving you. I got stuff to do. Can't sit around and play with those guys that respawn too fast. Alright. Coming. Went down the waterfall, you say? Didn't jump. Went down the side. Okay, I'm down. Got an alligator coming your way.
better cave. You see that ghost? Yep. He's gone now. I, don't, I think the ghosts are something important. I think they kind of tell you this is an important area to check out. We're not going here, though. Yeah. Yeah, well, there's a um, potion that does something with seeing ghosts. So, um, you may have to drink that potion when you, you know, you get a glimpse of somebody. Oh, so you can, like, commune with them or something? Or something, I don't know, or, or follow them or something. Okay, hold on. Okay, you will no longer affect me anymore. I turned off PvP. Oh, good deal. Okay, okay, so here it is. So if you stand here, let's see if this person is here all the time. She is. Okay. He's a level 3 Tanner. We have to take out the other guys on this side camp over here first. And I just, I'm just taking him out with an arrow. Is she a boss? Is she a uh, skull on her head? Uh, I don't know if she's a skull head. Kind of a personal question. So. I don't know why that guy did a Tarzan thing. Good deal. <laughs> okay. That arrow Ar cut him in half. Army my her Duncan and going after this lady all right here she comes oh yeah baby didn't like that did you uh-uh God take you no <laughs> nice. Good deal. Beat the hell out of her. Now we have to find a path to get her back home. Yes. So let's see here. Get rid of my Traduncan. Get a rope on her. Do me a favor. Mm. See if you can use your knife on this guy. Can't. To get your your goodies, carrying this lady. But well, put her down. And I don't want to put her down. Because just... I get my thing on the first hit. So I'm t I was just trying to see if we can both harvest people or not. I just got flesh, which means you got the good item. Okay. All right. Well, I was hoping. All right, how do we get her home? Can we walk through this without disconnecting her? <laughs> Is she going to drown in the water? I don't know. There's an alligator pad. You want to take care of that? Yep, yep. A couple of them, actually. Okay, you're down. I really need to make that skinning knife so I can start getting alligator skin. Although I suppose I can use the old skinning knife. Yeah, you get way much, you get much more with the iron one. Come on, don't skin. I need you to run cover for me. All right, all right.
Oh, you need food and water, huh? No, I'm full. Okay, spider down here. Oh, it's a corpse. Okay, never mind. Those alligator corpses from earlier. Uh, we're gonna have to go through this camp. I... Yeah, you wanna try to arch him down? Yep. Hey, hey! Hey, I didn't do anything to you. Okay, that archer is dead. Okay, going. I'm just running. Oh, dang, I got crippled. Oh. That was disgusting. I didn't know there was a finisher. Cut him in half. Um, no, I s impaled him with my spear. <laughs> Nice. Hey, my wheel is done. No more room at the station. I guess I drag this guy off? Yeah, you put him in your inventory. You can use him <clears throat> on your bar to put him out in the world. All right, Tanner's going. Uh, what if you don't? You just put him in a chest somewhere? What if you put him in a chest, yeah. What happens with that? <laughs> we have a people chest? I'm going to order my guy to fight these things over here. I could store unlimited train workers. Nice. Digby, what's going on? Everything about this game seems brutal and disgusting so far. It's kind of, uh, yeah, a little bit of that. Okay, my fighter's getting his butt kicked. Your fighter's doing what? My fighter is dead. Your fighter is dead. Yeah, your... I ordered him to fight these stone guys. Oh, he yeah. He's way too weak for that, man. Let's see. Combat tactic withdraw. Following behavior. Guarding behavior aggressive. Uh. Oh, did you give him armor? No, he came equipped like this. Oh, nifty. I guess I have to feed him? And gave him some meat. Let's see. If he's... Following behavior, I'm going to put passive. I don't know what that means. I just don't... I don't want him to follow me. I want him to stand there. All right. Of me. I don't know how hungry you're going to be. But you eat up, buddy. You stand there in the corner. Okay, so we have a Tanner and we have a Bearer. Tanner's going to be awesome. A Tanner 3? Yeah, I don't know if Bearer counts as a Crafter because that's my nest thing is capturing enemy Crafter. 
Oh, I didn't even do the thrall thing. Dang it. Should have been doing it. The thrall journey. You're so much smarter than I am. Got a bigger brain. What do you get for completing that journey? Some um, purple lotus orb. Um, purple substance. Convert a warrior. Obtain Gru. God, I should have been following this whole thing. Okay. Bearer only helps you carry more stuff in case you get over encumbered. Mm. Yeah, but... Why is that a bad thing? When we're going out doing our iron runs or whatever, just have a bear on passive that we just load up. Ghost will point you to some hidden chest. Nice. Well, I guess we should work on a third one, huh? Yep. This they take so long to convert. Yep, yep. I have um, most of the ingredients in my inventory. Let's see. Oh, I do have all the ingredients, okay. Wait. So there's a third one right there. You know, your, your guy did kill off these things over here. I well, I killed them. I killed him oh. after they killed him. Oh, okay, I see. Well, why don't you go get his heart or whatever? <laughs> go harvest him. I did. I did. Oh, you did. Okay. I only need to do the first whack. I don't need all the... You know, I just need the pristine stuff. I don't need the garbage flesh. DB asks if it was crafter. It isn't, but carrier stuff is good. I can see that if you're, like, gonna take the effort to go do a, um, you know, some sort of, like, iron run or a coal run or something like that. Oh, you wanna, you wanna help me with something? Sure, let me, I'm trying to clean up my inventory. Give me a second to put everything... I've got away. Sure, I need to fill up my water skins. They're both kind of empty right now. Uh, what'd you do with the thick hide? What'd I do with the thick hide? I have my thick hide. Okay. I don't know what you did with your thick hide. I think I have enough bricks now that I could make, upgrade my, um, altar. Where were we putting the bees, do you know? Do you remember? Uh, I have my own bees. I, I keep my stuff separate from yours. Okay, alright. My two chests are over here, and... Well, I was putting a bunch of stuff in common, so I'll... Oh, uh, I don't... What, what's their common chest? Uh, we don't have a common chest. I got some no, next to my bed. I was putting them in the workstations and stuff. Oh, workstations, yes. I put stuff in workstations, too. Oh, you got this ugly imp thing sitting in our house? How about outside <laughs> our house, man? Put your taxidermy stuff outside our house. It's ugly as hell. Especially that imp-looking one. That imp-looking one is great for hiding food, though. I went and I cleared that out earlier. Completely decimated the whole group of guys. It was awesome. How is that hiding food, though? Hide I, and food? Is that what you said? Hide saying? and food, yeah. Okay, I was like, hiding food. It's like, okay, I'm going to mm -mm. stash food in this guy's cave. Nope, hide and food. All right, are you going to come? Or no? I'm coming. I'm coming. He's still sitting there playing with your dang... 
you know, thing. Let's go, let's go. Little time to adventure today. Uh, if I were you, as I am going to do this. Bring yourself a bedroll, man. This guy's killed me three times today. All right. Have you been looking at the challenges? Challenge tab? No. Uh, is he on our challenge? Let me see. Yep, he sure is. Come on. He's number one on our challenge. Well, what is what does your challenge say? My challenge says demonic hyena. Okay, I've already killed one of those. Oh, wrong thing! I made the wrong thing. You killed a demonic Fiber hyena. Bedroll. Twine and stick. I need twine. That dude like. Yeah, I killed one earlier when I was out running around. I'm looking for the um, the nose thing that. Demon nose thing. That dude kicked my butt, man. Oh, I, I shot him from really far away. Is what I did. Mm hmm. I have defeat Curic as my third. Demonic crocodile was my second. And I have no idea where Curic is, but I guess I can go look him up. Just ran past everybody. Yep, I'm running too. I think um, we passed the crocodile on our way to this camp from our old camp. This is my old bedroll? Yes. Okay, I got a bedroll here. Okay, I'm bringing mine. One second. I had used up all the iron and the coal and stuff, putting all those things down. And then I came over here. And you don't, you don't see him. He's not out unless that's him over there but I don't think that's him over there nope here okay I see him I see where he's at Okay, let's give him a wide berth then. I've been marking these on my map, so... Where is he? He's laying down over here. Okay, one second. Towards these. Oh, is that him? No, that's not him. Once we find him... Okay, he's right. So if you look towards that direction I'm facing, he's laying on the ground. Let me get healed up first. Totally hits hard. Yep. Okay, I'm ready. I'll take a shot. Nice. Nice. Quick work of that boy. Yep. It's amazing how a second player helps. Absolutely. 
Uh, but I got no credit for it. What? Yep. Did I get the final blow? Hmm. Sorry, I didn't know that's a thing. Well, we'll have to come back when he spawns again. Yep, yep. Now, there's more than one spawn point. Um, the one that I killed was... Southwest of our camp? Oh, ah. My map open. Why they're going after you, dude? Oh, why would we get this stupid? I don't know. Interesting that I do the first hit and he comes for you. Yep. I'm injured. I don't know if that has anything to do with it. Maybe they go after the weakest person or maybe I just smell nice. I don't know. I don't know if you do smell nice. Is that a demon dude up there? Gonna go through the thrall can he's gonna beat at the thrall. <laughs> I don't know where you went. That's funny. <laughs> there was a couple of hyenas that were on top of the hill, and then I guess the only path down was over there by the thralls. <laughs> Come, I don't see what they are. Fighter. A cook. Whimper in terror, fool. They do smell the weakest. Soon my teeth will taste your throat. Ouch, ouch, so am I. Wow. I don't know who killed me, but uh, man, they were fast. It was a cook. The cook knows how to chop up meat. I don't know. When I was... <clears throat> the guy I was hitting, yep. I was obviously hitting him, but I wasn't doing any damage, so I don't know if there was some... I was killed sink by... Sink issue, or maybe he was just, you know, really high level. I was killed by the cook. That's what it said. I think we set a bedroll down. Yep. Sure. Is, okay, this one's me. No oh, man, this one's me. Harvest. I love how you get a ton of hide from your own body. I guess that could be a thing. Just run out, get killed, re reharvest yourself. Right, yeah. <laughs> a little unusual, but sure, whatever. Hey, where were we? Uh, 
don't know, man. I'm a little pissed about this cook. Do we want to make him one of ours? I think this is the fighter. Yep. Got a different tattoo pattern and bat skin. Interesting. Oh, I lost my tattoo pattern because I died. Interesting. Uh, do we want to try to get the cook? Yeah, we can try to get the cook. Let me switch over to a club. You got a rope, or am I dragging him? Uh, I, can, I got a rope. I'm going to drag him one second. All right. Just fixing it up to be full before I just start dragging him. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Don't drag him. Don't drag him. Don't drag him. Because I still haven't completed that part of the quest yet. Oh, okay. So it says... Oh, no. I needed a fighter or an archer. So go ahead. You can take him. Okay, because I need a crafter, so... All right. Did you already get the chest? I did. Bunch of uh, hides. We need coal? Did we burn through a lot of coal? I can get coal on the, for the way back. Um, last time I checked, we still had about 200 of each. In each, uh, 200. In each stack of each furnace. Okay. Dragging the cook through the stream. <laughs> Playing fishing for gators with a dragging a cook. I don't know if I'm down with the lock-on mechanic. Do you like the lock-on mechanic? Um, not particularly, no. Yeah, I don't care for the thrusting beyond your target thing either, but... Right, yeah. I guess it depends on what you're fighting. Certain, <clears throat> certain things, especially when I'm using the pin-down skill. Then it's really easy to hit them because I can't. They can barely move. You know what I mean? Right.
I don't know, maybe <clears throat> maybe when you're fighting the humans that jump around all over the place, maybe it's worth it. I'm going to top up uh, the other two, two stations with food. Yeah, I just pull out of this meat thing, man. We have so much meat. Does meat work? Yeah, I just dropped meat in there. More bark, though. For our drying stations. Alright, we can do a bark run. Already on it. The really nice thing about this, uh, purified flesh that I <clears throat> craft doesn't decay. Oh, nice. So this fiber thing, you said you can just repair it, huh? Yep. Takes oh. two twine, or I guess it depends on how badly damaged it is. Takes twine in. Okay. Toss my extra ones. And then I noticed my armor is starting to get a little low here. Yeah, I was hoping to get into the newer armor. Yeah, go for it. There should be enough stuff. Oh, well, my newer armor is going to be made from my shrine. Oh, what do you need for that? I have to upgrade the shrine before I can see the recipe. I can see that <clears throat> I get the recipe, but I can't see the ingredients yet. You know what I'm saying? I need another 100 brick. And eight more, eight more bits of flesh. How many times did you upgrade that so far? I haven't upgraded it all yet. It'd be my very first upgrade. And you see a recipe for your armor? Um, did you, did you do something that I didn't do? In the knowledge, in the knowledge, search for your god, the name of your god, and you can see, um, it all shows you all of the, um, in ingredients, um, arm, uh, recipes, all the recipes you unlock. So, the stuff that, that's, that we're getting from, from those cannibals. That's the stuff that I'm going to be able to craft. The mask and the chest plate and stuff. But I think the stats for the crafted ones are better than the dropped ones. Right. How do you know when you can upgrade your your station? Um, your altar. Well, you can upgrade it as soon as you have the ingredients. I know, but how do you upgrade it? Um, hold on, get the deck. Okay, so the, um, oh, you did about you do the, uh, what's it called? The Acolyte Journey? Uh, maybe not. Let me see. Uh, 
Uh, nope. Do not go back over here. That taken care of. I'll be able to put it in here. Nope. Okay. Well, after you complete that journey, you're going to get a new journey to upgrade your thing all the way to max. Gotcha. And if you, um, you know, level 20, you can do the, the first level, like level 50 to do the second level. I think it's 60 to do the last level, something like that. To the light, shy shadow. I killed a guy and his body disappeared. It's so weak. Yeah, that's not supposed to happen. I mean, if he fell off the side or something, but he didn't. Maybe he rolled. They do clip through sometimes. Yeah, he he went bye bye. How are you spending your points? Hmm. I'm trying to follow the journey stuff, but then... 
not. No? I mean, attribute points. Oh, my attribute points. Uh, since I'm agility base, I'll take agility to the max. Probably take strength halfway as it's damage base. Probably do expertise and grit a little bit. Some vitality. That's kind of how I'm working it. Yeah. I've Ooh. currently got 10 strength, 5 vitality, 5 grit. I'm just trying to figure out where to spend the rest of my points. Your, um... Your carrier is done. Oh, good deal. I'm going to go ahead and just have him stand in the middle of the base. Well, actually, no. I'm going to see if I can put him in a chest. Let's see if it lets me. Yeah, I wonder, I wonder if you could package him up whenever you want to package him up. You know, put him in a chest for a while until you need him to make a go. Go make a run to get resources and then stick him back in the chest. <laughs> right. Yep, yep. He is in my chest. Pretty cool. Once unpacked, they stay unpacked? Uh, that's too bad. No repackaging your guy, huh? <laughs> Tanner's getting close to being done. Don't okay, you well, look let's... fancy? What's going on, natural? I got a little little shaky shake going on. I need eight more bits of flesh. I'm gonna go kill some people. Do it. Do it. Go pillage. I just need to build a kingdom? I uh, know. That's, uh... That's a whole nother story. made these two large chests and then I've been sticking stuff in it and now they're almost full. Go figure. Oh, you know what? I forgot that we gotta improve chest size. Yeah, they're big. They hold lots. Tamed any animals yet? No, that stupid animal thing is massive. Massive piece. I'd have to, like, conquer this area over here. I'd have to put it down somewhere over there. There's a smaller animal pen? Let's see. Let's see, what is that pen called, by the way, here? Oh, here it is. Animal pen. Look at this thing. Look at that big mamba jamba.
And how can it be too far away to put down? Oops. Yeah, now I got these guys on me. Come on. Follow me around. I just got a shrunken head off this guy. Yeah, I was saying that in the beginning. I have two. They don't know what That's to use because it says treasure on it. Fun. They don't know what to use. Like if there's a salesperson that buys these or... Wow, that feral guy is... What feral guy? Damn, I didn't, I didn't have the potion on me either. I'm not going to be able to look at my inventory. I got an iron mace out of this guy. Wait. Damn, that guy's freaking tough. Is this your challenge guy? Knowledge tab is treasure for raids. Gotcha. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to switch weapons on uh weapon type, because I am not I need something that cripples him. You want my help? I don't know, man, because last time you didn't get credit, huh? Yep. You screwed me up last time.
Well, you know what I can do? I know what I can do. Let me, go, let me go back to the base. I have a weapon that is a level 35 weapon. It does like 35 damage or something like that. I think I'll use that sword on him. Uh. It's one of those ones I can't repair. So I've been holding off on using it. Right, right. What does the Gray Lotus Potion do? Uh, strength weapon, 15 damage. Hmm. Take that with me, too. Take one of those. Are you using a strength weapon? Yeah, that sword. I'm going to be using that sword. Oh, okay. Good deal. Be awesome. I could just find a place and just shoot at him. Right. Suppose I can. Let me see if this rock will give me a good vantage point here. I did. I found a spot I can snipe him. Good deal.
Okay, demonic demon dead. Nice. Hey, DBA, somehow I got a duplicate iron skinny knife. Oh, I'll take it. Yeah, I kind of figured you would. Natural potion of natural learning. Potion resets your knowledge points. I got three of those. From that guy? Yeah. Sweet. Do attacks on the skinny knife? Should I attack him on the skinny knife? <laughs> I don't want one shrunken head. They last just a minute and a half. You're talking about the the learning one, doesn't it? Resets your your points. How can it? How can it only last a minute and a half? Isn't it like a total reset? Resets knowledge points. Uh, the potion clears the knowledge of any uh, knowledge of civilization, wiping away learned skills until the inviter is left with nothing more than a vast potential for learning. Yeah, so it's not. I'm not gaining knowledge. It says I'm losing knowledge. I become dumb, yo. The potion of dumbness. Sword is so good. Yeah. Big damage, man. Oh, I only had two minutes to use the potion or they disappear. Ah, uh, and they have. They have disappeared. Interesting. Okay, well, I can craft those and we... I think we have the ingredients currently. Yeah, sure. Yeah, I went down that path too. I, I can craft this too. What you're saying is that consumable had a time limit. Alright, put my sword away for another day. Uh, iron. Where are you? Here you are. Here is the... Iron skinny knife on the ground. Oh, you just walked right, away. Grab a second. <coughs> yeah, the, uh... Iron mace that I found is only 18 damage. That's only one more damage than my spear. Okay, on the ground? See it? You, thank you. Mm -hmm. Don't know who I got that from, but happy day. Yeah, yeah. All right, I gotta go get one more piece of flesh. I'll be right back. I'm assuming your upgrade is probably similar to mine. You've got to have 30 of the thingamabobs. Yeah, probably. I haven't unlocked that knowledge yet.
Or did I unlock that? Maybe I did unlock that knowledge. Yep. It's 30 manifestations of zeal. It's... I don't know, um, the other things look like they come from, I don't know if they're bosses or you destroy somebody else's shrine, I don't know if it's PvP, the other things to get favor. All of our guys are done. Oh, good deal. Yep, I'm gonna go put the tanner on the tanning thing. So, oh, let's see if I go to this tanning thing. I just drop this guy in there? Is that how that works? Sure enough. Alright. Uh, the cook in the cooking station. I need to get credit for doing that, so. Oh, even the crafter also lasts two minutes? Oh, wow. Okay, so if we craft them, they're only two minutes long. Uh -huh. You have to make the decision to use it. Oh, completed the journey, and I got multiple journeys unlocked. Wait. Beastmaster and Overlord. She really increases the speed of crafting items. We, we haven't been poisoned yet, have we? Um, don't think so, but um, we go fight some spiders, I bet we get poisoned. Hmm. Two hundred fifty iron reinforcement. Wow, you had to do that. That ate a lot of iron up. Oh no, I only meant to make ten. Did I make it all? Don't know what you're talking about. Two hundred fifty iron reinforcement. I didn't mean to make two hundred fifty iron reinforcement. I only went to make ten. No, no, no. Mine takes two hundred fifty iron reinforcement. Is 
Oh, okay. I'm Your, sorry. Yours only takes ten to upgrade? No, I, I made those these bigger chests. Mine doesn't take iron reinforcement. Mine takes uh, brick and um, bone and um, something else. Twine, I think. Hmm. Yeah, well, mine is going to be a crap ton of iron. All right. Should not be a problem. You've got a crap ton of iron just waiting to be picked up. Upgrading my altar. Well, wait. Hey, wait. See what happens. There's big. Oh, I already started it. Yep. It's... Wait, I'm here. <clears throat> it's got a progress bar, so don't know when it's gonna happen. Well, how fast is the progress bar moving? Mm, it's about ten percent. Have you tried to jump into your pit of fire? <laughs> okay. Yep, it burns. I thought maybe it'd be like an instant consume you kind of thing. <laughs> it'd be like, you've been <laughs> sacrificed to your god. <laughs> take a mental note of how it looks now and then how it looks next. Okay, wow. We can take screenshots of how it looks now. Yeah, go for it. Okay, how do I... Is there a first person mode? Uh, what was it? Uh, P? Was it P? Yeah, P. All right. How do I... Is there a hide the interface? Alt-Z. Yeah, but you roll, too. I don't understand why you do that, but... Yep. There it goes. Going in exile. Took a picture. Boy, this is pretty anticlimactic, you know? you think it would be like some sort of swirling something. Yeah, yeah. Let me check on the progress. Uh, 80% done. Get out of my way, please. Sir, I was just looking oh, at your outfit. Dude. You missed the change, man. Did it grow? Got a tree. You got a tree and your rock thing. I can't believe you stood right in front of me as this thing was changing. <laughs> what a dork. Yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah. I'm dumb like that. And a tree. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. All right, I got a tree growing out of the back of our building now. That's sweet, man. Yeah, well, I didn't know when I built it that I had a tree growing <laughs> out the back. Right on. All right, now I can see my recipes. Okay. All right.
right, so it takes unblemished, the meat that I have to use, it takes unblemished meat, bone, oh, and I still have to make light padding. You have your light padded armor, right? I do. I'm currently wearing light padded, yeah, yeah. I just wanted to see if this is any better than... You know, the, the stuff that the bad guys are dropping. If you craft it, if it's better, you know what I mean? Yogg's temple is the smallest. Now I feel bad. I gotta go kill 30 people. Do my upgrade. And make a crap ton of iron stuff. But I think I'm gonna do that at another time. Tomorrow we're gonna be playing a little bit of Planet Crafter. I think it takes up to... I have no idea how it works. So, for those of you guys that want to join, you're more than welcome to join. Um, we're going to have to figure out how the whole save file works. If it's... Um, yeah, I don't know. I, I, I would make the assumption it's the host that holds the file. That has responsibility for the file, but... Um, Man, you never know, right? Yeah, I guess not. I will feast upon you. Go feast on that, dude. What am I feasting? I just killed a guy. Told me to feast on him. I feasted on him. Co-op up to nine players. Yeah, um... I'm really interested to see how that's all gonna, you know, play out. And to see who gets what. You know, how or how it works. How the save file works. I don't think they have dedicated servers or anything like that, right? does look like based on my screen you invite friends and display invitation codes okay so that's really only gonna last for like uh, it seems seems to me like the host has control over it What did you need to do to unlock the armor journey? Be cool. Because I can't make the padding because I haven't unlocked the... I think you had to do, you had to do armor, knowledge. right? 
The armor and knowledge? There we go. I'm in a sandstorm, by the way, are you? What's that? In a sandstorm? Not in a sandstorm. Need to figure out what's going on with that, because I am not... Having those problems. I don't know, is that something that you turned on? No. No sandstorms? <laughs> is that what you're thinking? Well, I don't know. You you did something else with that. Well, you turned off PvP, I guess that was one thing, but. Yeah, man, that was it. We just PvP'd us. Un PvP'd us. Yeah, I'm getting a little ticked that when I kill somebody off over here, their body is disappearing. What that's about? I don't know what that's about either. Unless their own people are running up to harvest a dead dude. And as for the antidotes, the ones that I make, I don't, I don't know what you make to make your thing, but I have to make an antidote to get me that coin. Yeah. And, uh, man, that's like 10 antidotes every time. I'm going to be overloaded with antidotes. Yeah, no, I'm, I make those purified flesh, which is a food. Gives me um, 40 health, 14 stamina. Yeah, that's and right. Doesn't decay and it uses up my, you know, food meter. Or gives up, you know, fills up my food meter. Yeah, that's really nice. I'm pretty happy with it. I thought it was going to give me strength. I didn't realize it was health and stamina. I thought it was going to be strength and stamina, but I guess I can't. Can't complain too much. Hells no. You're here too. Yeah, I need uh, I need stuff, need man. You. Yep, yep. Okay, I'll go find another camp then. Oh, 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 oh. You can help with this though. All right, sure. Wow, that guy killed me outright. 
Oh, that's a boss. He's got a name on him. Yep. Mulk the Smelly. Oh, crap. He got me, too. Is that my challenge guy? Nope. Aim thralls are good fighter companions. Uh, okay. Noted. Yeah, well, considering how quickly he beat our butts, makes a lot of sense. Try to beat some you sense into him. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'll take your heart. Did you kill off the carrier? I think I did, yeah, yeah. Do we want to try to capture this guy? Um... Yes, I think so. Do it. Oh no, I got stuck here, I got stuck here. Wow. Are you down? No. Pulling him out though. His bar's halfway. Oh, no, 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 I hit him with an arrow. Damn, how did I switch over to arrow? I need healing. Nice. Okay, he's down. Whew. Oh, we've attracted somebody. Hold on. Okay, you take care of him. I'll try to get Molt the Smelly out of here. Sounds good. Oh, I just got a language dictionary. Sweet. Understand what they're saying? No, I don't know how to... Can use, use it? it? Learned language, Black Kingdoms. Hmm. That's nifty. Too bad we couldn't rob Mulk the Smelly. He had a really cool weapon. I think <clears throat> you'll be able to interact with him and get it. After he's... You know what I mean? After he's done his thing. Done his time on the wheel. Alright, Mulk. Get to work, bud. This game really drags you in. Oh yeah, it does. It's fun.
I mean, Mulk's a cannibal. I guess I can make him eat his own stuff, huh? <laughs> In theory, I suppose. Tanner Lady produced 426 leather. Way to go, Tanner Lady. Yeah. Oh, named guy. Yeah, he's dead, though. Spiders killed him. Ooh, what's in his body? Bow and arrow. Bunch of... Um, leather armor, but it's... Clothing instead of armor. Leather apron, leather work gloves. Repair kit. Pretty garbage. But I don't know. <clears throat> he might have been a a good um, armor guy or leather working guy or something. Mm -hmm. I mean, these journey things are pretty nice, but, um, you know, they're just kind of guiding you to. With the exception that they give you a recipe sometimes after you complete them. Right. I guess the biggest question is how many knowledge points do you get? I mean, level 23 right now. By the time you get up to level 60, do you have enough points to do what? Right, yeah. Yep, yeah, but then how does it work when you um, respec your knowledge points? You know, does a building that you use the knowledge point to build stay there? If so, then... You know, you do all the journeys, and then when you're done, unspec. <laughs> I don't know. 
and respec into other things. Yeah, yeah. I mean, putting out furniture is just purely decoration. You won't get to unlock all the skills with all the points you get up to level 60, but... There's always a way to get it all. Oh, you're talking like purchase it? Is that what you're saying? Well, I did find a um, an NPC that seemed like he was he would have given me my acolyte skill. Mm. So I already had it, so it was grayed out. Mm. So I don't know. Maybe you just got to find the right NPCs to learn some of the basic stuff. Go! Run! Run! Dodge! Have you tried claws at all? I haven't. I'm looking at the recipe for the punching daggers. The problem is I need to go look on a wiki or something to see what kind of benefits I get from it. The current weapon is uh, bleed and armor penetration. 16%. Yeah. Well, I've got some bone ones here if you want to try them out. I, I have some in my... already. Okay. Or I did. I might have thrown them away. I might have saw that they weren't that great. What's the damage on them? Well, these are bone ones, and they say... Four damage, but they also cause bleed. Yeah, no, nah, we'll pass. I think that was the main reason I didn't didn't do it the first time around, because the damage was half. Half of what your daggers were. Yep. Really need more hot bar space, you know? Yep. Oh, I've got another named guy here. <clears throat> I've already almost killed him, though. Let's do that. Healing. Get that guy. Trying to. Alright, I'm gonna get a bunch of stone. I need to 
I need a uh, hundred bricks. I'm gonna start pro right. processing some Did stone I put for that. the extra bricks back when I? I have no idea. There was ten in the furnace. But I guess technically I needed ninety bricks, but is that a brick? Oh, that says hardened brick. You have ten hardened bricks in there. I need to need regular bricks. Hundred regular bricks, and I need a hundred insulated wood. Insulated wood. Or how do we make insulated wood? Good question. Is that taking the dry wood and putting it into the? No, there's already dry wood there. Do I need a recipe for that? Yeah, I couldn't I couldn't drop the guy. All right, I could have sworn I left um bricks in one of these. Maybe I accidentally left them in my my thing when I built it. Yes, there's 67. I'm bringing you 67. I'll go ahead and put them in the one that you're currently smelting with. You have 76 now. Man, some of these fights go from, you know, easy, I don't get touched, to, oh crap, I'm dead. Right. Okay. Where did I put all the resin at? If iron tools are giving us this much, I wonder what steel tools are going to give us. Question. Do we have the ability to make steel tools? Not yet. Level 35.
Is there any reason why there's an... an improved torch in the furnace? Don't know. Might have been one of those times where you were pressuring me to leave and I just was trying to find some place to throw something. Oh, is that what it was, huh? <laughs> Ooh, why won't you move? Okay. Oh, you were able to stack the chest and get to the bottom one and open it yep. up? Yep. Just by accessing it from the side? No, just aim a little lower when you're looking. Interesting. Got a ton of bone arrows, like 400 on me now from killing all these people. I don't know if you need arrows, but I'm about to donate. I, I have a, a bunch as well. Give it to the archer out there. All right. He's got an extra 200. Wait. Wow, we need to make an iron run. Give me a minute. I need to did all this so that I can craft some stuff. So I'm going to go craft and compare. right I'm still waiting for 20 more insulated wood and then I have a dismantlers bench so we can dismantle all of this armor and stuff that we're finding oh nice all right I'm making a yogurts watcher mask So is your special is your special armor better than the heavy armor? It's light armor. So the mask that I just made is follower damage plus eight, concussive damage plus ten. I don't know what concussive damage is. Armor value eighteen helmet. Nice. So my current helmet is 
it's light, but it's armor value six. So it's a definitely improvement in armor, but... Yeah, plus two stats as well. Concussive damage. What would, is that blunt? What is concussive damage? Yeah, I would think blunt. That'd be my guess. I'm gonna look it up. Oh, knocking out thralls, it looks like. Hmm. Maces, Warhammer, that sort of thing is concussive. Okay, so blunted arrows, blunted bolt, blunted javelin. Heavy truncheon, iron truncheon. Interesting. I don't know that that's, I mean, I don't know, I mean, it'd be a nice set to put on for going after thralls, but as far as running around, I almost would kind of rather have, uh, well, is it all thrall based or is it just the helmet is thrall based? Look up the rest of your set on the wiki. See what it looks like. All right. My helmet is also concussive damage, follower damage. I have a choker, follower damage, concussive damage. Seems like it's all thrall related. Three pieces I looked at are all. Yep. Yep, yep. Significant improvement in follower damage, though, if you were the complete set. Mm hmm. All right, we have a deconstruction bench. Let me see. What piece of garbage did I not throw away? been aggressively throwing away all those armors. You have a piece of armor out there that I can use in that little chest out there? Yeah, yeah. I should have two of every of the stuff that we've been finding. Take two items and I'll just deconstruct to see if it works. See what it does, yeah. Well, leather Can stuff gave me leather and bone. All right, I'm going to deconstruct this iron mace that I'd saved. Let's see what that... Oh, well, it's going to give you back iron. Ten iron, not too bad. Mm-hmm. All right, everybody. Well, thanks for watching three hours. I didn't mean to play for three hours. Pretty good stuff. 
really enjoying the game. We have a long way to go before we get uh, to our top levels and stuff. Play one more. <laughs> Good time. Time flies. No doubt. No doubt. I mean, this thing is like moving. Well, we have the server for 90 days. So for those of you guys that are on Patreon that want to join into the server, you know, you're welcome to jump into the server. We got this little base going on here. If you want to make your own base, so be it. Uh, we can go on adventures together. I know that uh, later on some of the big boss battles are pretty epic. More people the merrier to get involved on those. And... Uh, yeah, that's it. At any rate, talk to you guys later. Good night, everybody. Bye. Bye. Jump in at any time. Yeah, you can play at any time. Servers 24-7. See you, everybody. Bye.